Hey gang, Eli and Josh here with your weekly mobility mend. So today we're gonna to give you an idea to help with the depth in any hip tightness and the bottom of any squats that you're having. That could be with a barbell, it could be a pistol, anything in between. So the first one is going to be a lateral hip mobilization with some active external and internal rotation of the hip. After we get some motion in there, we're gonna follow it up with utilizing these same muscles for a internal motion there, external motion here, working it both essentially, concentrically of the left side, then the right side, back and forth, both directions, and we do both sides here. Okay, to set up our first mobilization here, we're going to fixate a pretty thick one and a half to two inch band to a rig or something that's not gonna move. Then you're gonna put it in your leg that's closest to the rig and tuck it pretty far up into that hip crease. You're then gonna get onto all fours like Josh here, get some tension on the band so it's pulling his femur towards the band and he's going to internally and externally rotate that leg. This is gliding the femur out and stretching the joint while activating the motion through the rotation that we need for the bottom of the squat. I'd recommend doing 30 seconds of this one to five times pre any deep squats. Okay, once we've mobilized the joint, now we're going to utilize that new space that we've gained with some activations. So you can see Josh here on his right side, his femur is in internal rotation, and on his left side, his femur is in external rotation. So as he leans back towards me, he's eccentrically loading the internal rotators on his right side, then concentrically pushing him forward into an eccentric load of his external rotators on his left side, and then concentrically pushing back the other direction. So this might feel pretty tight. You can start with a really controlled, it should be a comfortable range. And then as you get more comfortable, you can push yourself deeper towards the ground and then deeper up in the opposite direction. Recommend aiming for this for 15 repetitions at a time. Maybe retest your squat depth or whatever your deep hip flexion is gonna be for that day. And then jumping back into this for three to five repetitions total.